I'm going to get deep here for a second. Don't get deep. I'm going to get deep with you. Uh, I don't. No, I'm going to get deep. We're going to get deep here. Uh, no, no, Our, please, this don't. Is, this is getting deep with the pervert. Barry and the pervert. Fuck. <laughs> that doesn't sound right. And I'll be honest with you, Shad, like every week. This is starting to sound like a snuff film here. Every week I, I buy the lottery tickets, you know. <laughs> yeah. And I never win. Yeah. I, if there's a God, why won't he let me win? <laughs> well, because it doesn't work that way. I just want to win. It's just money. Everybody. I feel as though the good Lord should let me win every now and again. <laughs> Everybody wants to win. It's just. Well, not as much as me. It's random. Yeah, not as much as me. No one wants to win more than me. I, I think there's a lot of people probably want to win more than you. Oh, bullshit. I don't play it that often. Every now and again, and I know that I'm just throwing money away and my, my logic kicks myself in the nuts for it. Well, but you, I do it every now and again. You have been failing in logic lately. <sighs> Example, your hair. <laughs> <laughs> what about You would hair? think, logically, you would get a haircut. <laughs> yeah. And now you look like a goddamn hippie. <laughs> well, I'm a been a hippie, you know, in disguise. It's so not fun. working, Chad. <laughs> Just get rid of it. I promised my niece I wouldn't. Really? Yeah. Why? Because she likes it. Really? It's the closest thing I'll ever have to having a kid. Daughter is my, my brother's, my brother's son and his, his daughter are the closest things I'll ever have of having yeah, all kids. All right, all right. We're going to pull out because we're getting too deep. Yeah, we're getting a little deep. Yeah. yeah. So we're just going to pull out of each other. I want to be... And I'm not... A little, not, little too deep for us. Yeah. Get out of me. Yeah. I'm out of him. Yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> I have pulled out of Barry. <laughs> All right, folks. <laughs> we're going to take another break. We'll be right back. What? No, you can do the... Bring us back. You're recording. No, I'm not. God. And we're back. <laughs> So, um, boring time with Barry? Sound good? Yeah. All right. Well, I got a story. Not a good one, of course. Cause Never a good one. Well, no, it's boring time with Barry. Because it's boring time with Barry. You know the one associate we have, the big guy? Yep. We'll yep. call him... Um, the one that used to work under you, and now he doesn't work under you. No, he doesn't, he doesn't work for me anymore. Nope. Anyway, I was... Uh, Trying to do the bends, and uh, I needed a ladder because, of course, I'm not, I'm, you know, height challenged. You're a short man. <laughs> short man. Anyway, so I was, I was kind of messing with him. I needed the ladder. I looked yep. at, uh, I said, Daniel, he had, had a, this uh, crate of eggs. And I said, uh, Daniel, grab me the ladder. You know, he looks at me, ladder. I said, Yeah. Give me a ratter. Give me a ratter. And he had the eggs. He started coming towards me. I said, no, a ratter. A ratter. And he did this circle, dude. <laughs> he, did, he did a circle. Not a 360, mind you. A 720 a couple of times. And I was laughing so hard, but I felt bad. I said, yeah. I, a ladder. And the look that he gave me, I he could have. I mean, if he could have killed me right then and there, <laughs> and I know he was thinking of it because we were in the cooler. There I, was, think, I think I've seen that look. Yeah, it, we were in the cooler, and he probably could have gotten away with it. And he's a big guy. He's a big kid. Yeah. So he went and grabbed me the ladder. <laughs> Didn't say a word after that. <laughs> yeah, that's boring time with Barry. Yeah, that was pretty good. <laughs> that wasn't you know, That wasn't too bad. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, we're going to try something a little new here. Uh, this is called, uh, this is called Inner Feelings with the Pervert. I thought we were going to call it the top five. Uh, it is a top five. I just want to call it Inner Feelings with the Pervert. Don't fucking ruin it. <laughs> anyway, this is where I, I, I kind of I get, I get more in touch with like the, my feelings and, 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 and his feelings. And it's, no, not much. And, and we, we Don't just... Don't drag me into this. Oh, you're getting in on it. No. I, and, we, and we just... I just... I let, I let me you be, in you. No, I, you know. Huh? No. You're not going to be me. And I sure... I, no, 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 no. I'm saying I am going to enter the audience. 
okay, what audience? Well, well, we got Cooper over there. We got an audience of millions of people listening to us. Please. Oh, and it just just a little interjection here. I love my dog, but you got to talk really, really strongly to him for him to sometimes listen. Yep. So we'll just just get that out there. And if that doesn't work, we got the switch. <laughs> we don't. No one hits my dog. I don't hit my dog. No one touches my dog. Finally. No. Now then. Anyway, get back to your, your deal. <laughs> so this is where I would like to talk about the top five things that bother me. Like my dog's nose up your crotch? Apparently he... Loves my crutch. A lot of people love my crutch, and I don't know what to do about it. (laughs) 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 All right, what is the jello pudding? thing shed that i want to talk about okay. and these are very important things to, to discuss why why am i like, so afraid the the top five like actresses like with the most like with the best breasts that out there. best breasts all right the best breasts out there on, on, on actresses i'm not getting in on why that not because this is something that you should be in on i you're gonna tell me you're like yeah i like her breasts no those are great breasts no i'm not gonna say that why not because it's nobody's business. It's my business. Who I like and who I don't like is my business. Are you shitting me? No. You're Come. my favorite turd. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> right, and, and this is in no particular order, except for maybe number one. Because this is one that has stuck with me since I was a kid. Emma Stone. I've never seen her breasts. <laughs> don't you talk ill of her! <laughs> Sleazeball. <laughs> God! Yeah, yeah. But like, um, do you know who um, Alexandria Daddario? I want to say her name is. Nope. Um, very young, talented actress. You know, uh, she's been in a couple films here and there. Nothing I can really like say off the top of my mind. But um, she was in True Detective. I think the first season. Oh. Yeah, which was the best season, and uh, she got like full on naked in it. Oh yeah. Yep, and them titties could smile. Okay. Yeah, so there's her. Now let's see, who would be number four? Shat, do you have one that you would like to throw in? No. Really? See, this this is why we have problems with feminists and all that other bullshit. People like you. What? I appreciate their bodies. Yeah, yes, but, you know... What? If, if, if a girl wanted to talk about top five dicks, sure... <laughs> I don't care. Talk about the all the dicks in the world that you want. Oh, I know, but it's just as misogynist. <laughs> if you want, show we can talk about top five dicks. Just go on with your misogynist, whatever. <laughs> well, we were discussing this, and you're like, Dude, I'm not you should totally nothing. just talk about tits. I'm like, do you really think so, Shay? He's like, yeah. Ew, <laughs> I did not say that. I'm like, all right, Shad, I'll talk about tits. And you're like, yeah, I want talk about tits. <laughs> I want to talk about NPR news, and you ruined it for me. Yeah, well, you know, no one listens to NPR news. Uh, well, it's better than... Let's look- see, who would be number... Who would be another person whose rack is just phenomenal? I, I don't look at just a woman's breasts, man. I like women, you know? I look at the uh, whole package. I look at the whole body. Yeah, I know. The face. I'm just talking about one in particular. And and what I mean about the whole body, I mean like their their personality and their their... Is this getting soft with Barry again? No. <laughs> <laughs> you know what was weird when you were telling me about that? Is that you were slightly rubbing your crotch. <laughs> <laughs> so who's the real fucking pervert? Anyway. <laughs> Let's see. Who? <laughs> so Angelina Jolie, when she first started out, like in the movie Gia. Did you ever see the movie Gia? I think so, yeah. Oh, man. Is that with Antonio Banderas? No, that was original sin. That movie was garbage. But no, it was like one of her like, first films that she made, I think. Okay. And uh, she played, uh, it's um, based on a true story or whatever. It's uh, based off of a model. I can't remember her name exactly. It was Gia. And, uh, you know, had some, had some pretty wild lesbian machines. You know, I think I need to cut my nails here. 
God, I hate you so much. <laughs> and like, yeah, phenomenal, phenomenal little package on her. I think it'd be. Uh, and I wanted to save this one for like number one, but like right now, like I can only think of three. So this end up might just end up being a top three until I can remember something. Do you remember Fast Times at Ridgemont High? Yeah, vaguely. Do you know? Do you know what scene I'm talking about? No. Do you remember the scene with um, Phoebe Cates where she comes out of the pool? Yeah. You know, it's that whole wow, 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 and then she's like this. Wow. <laughs> Do you remember that part? I. To no, this you know, day, honestly, and no. she's actually like gorgeous. To this day, she's aged incredibly well. Those are still probably like some of the best breasts I've ever seen in my entire life. It's probably some of the first ones you've ever seen. Probably. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> so. After, but like before that, I was just like you know like, just like doing kid things and playing with sticks and like you know throwing mud. And then one day I just happened upon that scene and like, oh. <laughs> One ball dropped after the other, and that's when I was hooked. <laughs> that's when it dropped? And that's then... when they dropped, and I was like, I was hooked. I was like, wow! <laughs> this movie's pretty cool! <laughs> What's going on down there? <laughs> the pants are getting tight! <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, I'll just say top three for now. Okay. Because, like, really, it's hard for me to think of was two there, the, oh, oh, yeah, that was three. Yes. Oh, uh, well. So, yeah, that was that was my top three with uh, <laughs> inner feelings with the pervert and Shad. No. No. Don't. 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 Don't what? Don't lump you in. Don't, don't lump you in, in on that? Yeah, don't. Oh, 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 oh. Because, you know, Shad's in touch with his feelings and his soul. I, not, I don't have a soul. You got a soul. And there's no such thing. Do you wear shoes? Oh, balls. <laughs> <laughs> You're a complex man, Shad. I don't understand you sometimes. So It's like the new Star Wars. You refuse to watch the new Star I'm Wars. I'm so fucking over Star Wars. I like I like all the Star Wars up to the newest one. I'm but I'm done. I'm done with Star Wars. Ugh. I don't need to see the new one. I refuse to watch the new one. In fact, my mom bought it. I was over there. I was helping her do her weeding around her, her yard today. Yeah. And I went in. I bought some breakfast. And I was eating breakfast. And I was watching TV. And she had the new movie sitting out right there. And I watched uh, Captain America instead. I'm not like the greatest fan of Captain America either. But I wait, would wait, rather wait, wait, watch... Wait, which Captain America are you watching? The Winter Soldier. I watched Winter Soldier. The Winter Soldier is still fantastic. Yeah, no, it's a great... It's it's a pretty good movie. I mean, yep. it's not my favorite. But it was better than... Yep. Captain America, Winter Soldier. Watch it now on so, Netflix. No, I've never, I have not seen the newest movie. I refuse to watch it. I'm done. You refuse to watch it. You're yep. done. My God, Shad, you are draining me. <laughs> why? I don't understand why you're so dickish about certain things. You're dickish about certain things. Like what? Everybody's, like what? Like every, what? Everybody's dickish about certain. Like you things. name me one thing I'm dickish about. You won't wear shorts. I'll, I will when I, if I ever go to a strip club. Why would you wear... Why? So, when I joined a bowling league, like two or three years ago... Okay. This guy who was on our team, we didn't really know him, you know, but he was he was fun to shoot the shit with, you know? We were talking about strip clubs, because I've never been to one. Uh-huh. And I wanted to go to one. And he was telling me, like, if you go to a strip club, man... I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to give him, like, his own voice. If you ever go to a strip club, man... I, this isn't how he talked, but this is the only voice I can think of to get him. Anyway, so he's like, if you ever go to a strip club, man, let me reiterate, this isn't what he sounded like. This is just the voice you, I want to give You've him. said that. Yeah. Okay, I just want to make that clear. Hey. Let me tell you something, man. If you ever go to a strip club, brother. <laughs> okay, wait, he started sounding like Hulk Hogan. <laughs> yeah, give him Hulk Hogan. Okay, okay. Just, just, no, just... no, no. So he's like saying, if you ever go to a strip club. Man. Okay. <laughs> At some point in time, Alex, <laughs> we have to get past okay, if you, if you ever, ever get... go to a strip club, man. What you got to do is when you go get a lap dance, you want to make sure you're wearing shorts. And I'm like, okay, why do I want to make sure I'm wearing shorts? And he's like, 
because it ha- it gives the girl easier access access to your junk. And I'm like, huh? I I never even thought of this. And I'm like, just wear baggy pants. Same fucking baggy difference. Baggy pants. How the f- no? Because that way, all she has to do is just like slide it up the whole, slide up like you know the, your pants. That's it. They don't do that. Well, I guess the ones that he went to did. He's the fucking lying. I, hey, I don't know. And every person is different. Maybe they didn't do that with you because, well, you lick it. <laughs> but, like, he says you want to wear, like, you, kinda, you know, you want to wear shorts. You kind of hurt and, my feelings there. <laughs> and, and, you know, you may or may not have to and wear underwear, underwear. I don't use the word feelings lightly. You kind of hurt my feelings. Do you want to talk about it, No, Chad? fuck no. Let's, let's, I'm over it. Shall we Shall we get soft with no, Harry? No, I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> I'm okay. I'm an old, old fuddy-duddy bastard. You are. I think we should uh, leave, huh? Oh, I, well, yeah, you queued up the music. Well, yeah, yeah, I thought that's what we were doing. All right, folks, I uh, would just like to say thank you for tuning in. Um, if you like this uh, video, whatever the fuck it is, hit like. If you want to subscribe, subscribe. That would be very nice of you. We appreciate it. Although I don't blame you if you didn't. Just want to say good luck, good health, and so long. Say bye, Alex. Well, goodbye. Captain, press stop.